Let's build a new F35. This F35 will be slightly different compared to its previous uh, versions. Um, before I always used a 120mm uh, FASA EDF, but this time I'm going to use a 90mm smaller EDF. This will reduce a little bit of weight. This little uh, FASA EDF can push also over 4 kilos. And uh, instead of 12S uh, LiPos, we're going to uh, downgrade it to 6S LiPo. And this will gain into a flight time of 2 minutes or 2.5 minutes. And also, we have to make the lightweight uh, construction a little bit more lightweight. Uh, therefore, we're going to use lightweight uh, PLA uh, filaments to build the internals. Uh, the outer skin will be made out of carbon fiber. So I think this is going to be a cool plane. Um, this model is going to be my first transition model. Uh, we know how to fly this model. We know how to hover this model. Uh, we tested the 3 BSM module in the, in the Crestle model. And, um, and I made some adjustments to my 3 BSM. <laughs> um, as you can see, I add some new bearings. This will smoother up the rotation for uh, jaw and stability. So, enough of uh, introduction. Let's start making the F-25. Okay guys, the back section is finished uh, with this carbon tubes installed and everything fits really nicely. It's also really stiff and it's also really really lightweight. So let's proceed with the front section of the hover test frame.
Okay guys, I really, really enjoy this build. Uh, everything fits like a puzzle. That's the big advantage of drawing everything in solid works. But wait a minute, look at it. It's really, really big. And it looks so good. You can all, almost imagine it how to how to hover it. We're going to hover this again in the living room like I used to. But this is amazing. So let me put it back. So next week we're going to start making the landing gear. We have the lift top fan doors. We got 17 of doors opening and closing on this F35 model. Um, everything has to be scale, everything has to be stiff working um, also though we're going to start making the composite skins the upper skin is already done and yeah it also fits perfectly into the mold um, yeah this is it for this week's video i guess and uh, if you want to support this project uh, please find me on patreon and for future plans and designs for the people who wants to build this f35 model you can find the plans when they are ready on myminifactory.com i will put uh, i will upload the 3vsm i will upload the in inner parts of the f35 and uh, yeah just support me on that uh, website guys so i'll say a big thumbs up for the youtube algorithm and uh, if you have any questions or comments just let me know okay see you next week bye bye Carbon.